Hey guys, Matt Beck from freesaloneducation.com and I'm gonna walk you through how to either intensify a red color, make it brighter, or how to deepen it. There's a lot of easy ways to do this. A lot of people look at intensifiers, maybe your color line has one, some kind of color shot or some intensifier within the color that you can drop in. But So I wanted to help you understand what you're doing and why you're doing it. Um, so let's say that we have our red color. We're gonna use Play-Doh here. Uh, it's just the easiest way to break it down. We have our primary colors, red, blue, and yellow. So we have our red color. Um, let's say that's a medium red, maybe like a 6R. And what I wanna do is I wanna intensify, I wanna make it brighter. Normally our first thought is I'm gonna add more red to it. I'm gonna, maybe I have a 6R and I'm gonna go 6RR or I'm gonna add more red shots to it or something like that. But that's not gonna help brighten your tone. Um, so basically, this is what you're initially doing. Let's say I have our red color already, and I take some red shots and I add it to my color. Well, I mix that in, I put it on the hair, it's not gonna brighten it, because you're adding red to red, just you still have red, right? So um, that's the first thing. Second thing is, if I wanna brighten it, I wanna move up on the color wheel. So let's look at orange tones, yellow tones. I don't wanna add equal parts, red and yellow because what's that gonna make? It's gonna make orange. But what I wanna do is just add a little bit to it. So maybe adding just a little bit of a gold tone to your color formula or adding an orange tone to your color formula just to brighten up your red a little bit and have it appear brighter. As soon as I add that little bit of yellow to this, um, to the Play-Doh, the tone overall brightens up. So hopefully you guys can kind of see this, but um, Try it at home. Uh, visually, this is a pretty easy thing to do. Um, we pick up the Play-Doh at Staples, so it's simple. Um, and you can mess around with different, different colors, neutralizing and doing different things like that. But hopefully you can see there's a little bit of a difference in brightening up your color. Now, if I want to deepen the tone, I just add a little bit of a blue base or maybe a green base, something uh, deeper on the color wheel and uh, or a violet tone. And that's going to overall make the color appear deeper. So if I'm trying to show depth within a haircut um, or something like that, shadows within uh, the hairstyle, then I would add a little bit of blue to the red tone. Uh, and just depending what the guest wants, if they want that brighter tone, they wanna see a, that fire engine red, the only way that we're gonna create that is adding more brightness to our color. So I hope that this is an easy way for you guys to remember this, to break it down, pick up some Play-Doh, have fun with it, Try neutralizing color, try doing different things, and I think you'll, you'll have fun with the results. This is something I learned a long time ago, and it's helped me really understand how hair color works. So, hope this helps you guys. Check us out, freesaloneducation.com. Make sure you subscribe to us on YouTube so you get all the updates on everything that we're doing. Um, all right, guys, we'll see you.